Mastering Longitudinal Study Design Leaders must own and execute their operational excellence vision. Who is responsible for ensuring that the primary goal of the longitudinal study, which aims to achieve operational excellence, is clearly defined and successfully executed through the implementation of effective strategies and processes that drive continuous improvement and efficiency? Ensuring the primary goal of a longitudinal study aimed at achieving operational excellence is clearly defined and successfully executed requires a structured approach. This involves assigning responsibilities, establishing effective strategies and processes, and fostering a culture of continuous improvement and efficiency. Firstly, a dedicated project manager should be appointed to oversee the entire longitudinal study. This individual should have a deep understanding of the study's objectives, scope, and timelines. They should be responsible for ensuring that all stakeholders are aligned and working towards the common goal of achieving operational excellence. To define the primary goal, a thorough needs assessment should be conducted to identify the key performance indicators KPIs, that require improvement. This involves analyzing existing operational data, gathering insights from stakeholders, and benchmarking against industry best practices. The project manager should work closely with subject matter experts to develop a concise and measurable goal statement that aligns with the study's objectives. Once the goal is defined, the project manager should establish a cross-functional team comprising representatives from various departments involved in the study. This team should be responsible for developing effective strategies and processes to achieve the goal. They should conduct a root cause analysis to identify inefficiencies and opportunities for improvement, and design targeted interventions to address them. To ensure the successful execution of the strategies and processes, the project manager should develop a detailed project plan, including timelines, milestones, and resource allocation. This plan should be regularly reviewed and updated to ensure that the study remains on track. A crucial aspect of achieving operational excellence is to foster a culture of continuous improvement and efficiency. This can be achieved by implementing a quality management system that encourages employees to identify areas for improvement and suggest innovative solutions. The project manager should establish a feedback mechanism that allows employees to provide input and receive timely feedback on their suggestions. To drive efficiency, the project manager should implement process mapping and workflow analysis to identify bottlenecks and areas for streamlining. They should also develop and track key performance metrics to measure the study's progress towards achieving operational excellence. In addition, the project manager should identify opportunities for automation and technology integration to enhance efficiency and reduce errors. They should work closely with the IT department to develop and implement customized software solutions or integrate existing systems to support the study's operations. To ensure the sustainability of the improvements, the project manager should develop a training program for employees to enhance their skills and knowledge in areas such as process improvement, quality management, and data analysis. This program should be regularly updated to reflect changes in the study's operations and emergence of new best practices. Furthermore, the project manager should establish a governance structure to oversee the study's operations and ensure that all stakeholders are aligned and working towards the common goal. This structure should include regular meetings with stakeholders, progress reports, and a clear escalation process for addressing issues and concerns. Finally, to ensure that the study's progress towards achieving operational excellence is transparent and measurable, the project manager should develop and track a balanced scorecard that includes metrics such as process efficiency, quality, cost, and customer satisfaction. This scorecard should be regularly reviewed and updated to reflect changes in the study's operations and emergence of new best practices. In conclusion, achieving operational excellence in a longitudinal study requires a structured approach that involves assigning responsibilities, establishing effective strategies and processes, and fostering a culture of continuous improvement and efficiency. By following these steps, the project manager can ensure that the study's primary goal is clearly defined and successfully executed, resulting in improved efficiency, quality, and customer satisfaction.